can I integrate Oracle's Exeter Cloud Service or Exeter Clouded Customer with Microsoft Azure Active Directory? Can we integrate that? That was a question asked by Bharat. So I thought I'll take this opportunity to answer that question so that it can be helpful for you as well. So first of all, uh, why you are integrating uh, this Active Directory or Azure Active Directory? It's primarily for storing your users so that the users that are in Active Directory can authenticate to Excel Data Cloud Service or Excel Data Clouded Customer. First of all, you do understand the multiple parts. First is that you can log into the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure where Excel Data Clouded Customer or Excel Data Cloud Service is installed and configured. So first is OCI integration. Then second is the Excel Data Cloud Service or Excel Data Clouded Customer virtual machine itself. Excel Data Cloud Service or Excel Data Clouded Customer consists of multiple virtual machines on which your database is installed. Second part of that is you can integrate those virtual machines so, uh, with Active Directory so that if you need to authenticate or if you need to log into these virtual machines instead of using SSH keys, you're using user ID and password in Azure Active Directory or Microsoft Active Directory. So third part is that you can, uh, the databases that are installed on the Exeter Cloud Service that database can be integrated with the Microsoft Active Directory or so that if a user needs to log into the databases, they can use the user ID and password configured in Active Directory, that user ID details. So all of that is possible if you're integrating with databases. Uh, there are multiple databases can run on single Accelerator Cloud Service or Accelerator Clouded Customer. Within those databases, you can decide and say, hey, I want to integrate only one database or two databases or all of the databases, you have an option to do that integration. And for that integration, you're going to use enterprise or EUS feature, which is a enterprise user security feature that comes with a databases. And for that integration, you have to follow uh, the database administration guide or, or Oracle's database version that is installed and configured on Excel Data Cloud Service or Excel Data Clouded Customer. If you want to integrate your virtual machine with Active Directory, then you go to use the authentication module or PAM we call, we call that authentication module needs to be configured or LDAP must be configured with the virtual machine of Exeter Cloud Service. If you are doing uh, the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure so that you can manage your Exeter Cloud Service itself, that integration which is with OCI, for that you have to use the, uh, the Act Active Directory Foundation Service in order to integrate with Active Directory. So all of that is possible. It's down to the requirement. So if you have that question being asked by your customer, you can you need to first understand what integration you're looking for or what exactly they want to protect within this either OCI, Exeter, Exeter Cloud Service virtual machines or databases. I hope that answers the question. If you have a question like these, leave it under, under comment. But if you are a database administrator, if you're a DBA and would like to learn uh, the how to upgrade your knowledge to Exeter Cloud Service, you can join our free class that I do with another expert, Amit where we teach you on how to go from a complete beginner or as a DBA to an uh, databases on cloud or Oracle database on cloud, including Exeter Cloud Service, Exeter Clouded Customer. The free class link is on k2academy.com forward slash cloud DBA02. With that, this is Atul from Team K2 Academy. I'll, come, I'll be back with another short tip like this. Take care and bye for now.